Jeff Loveness looks like most other college students you see around Malibu, but on the internet, Jeff Loveness is a man of many faces. Jeff's video parodies and his YouTube channel have become internet hits. He's portrayed everyone from founding father Thomas Jefferson, to Superman, to Harry Potter. It's something he's been doing since he was a kid. I started making videos when I was about five years old with my brother. Uh, we'd make little James Bond movies and I played James Bond and I was like six or five. Jeff started out as a history major at Pepperdine University, but it wasn't long before his passion for making videos ignited a change of heart and a change of major. Uh, and then I got involved with The Random Show my freshman year after pitch night and I just started making sketch after sketch and, and writing them. And uh, I decided to switch over to telecom because I could check out cameras, I could get my own equipment, and it just seemed the logical step. It's worked out so far, but I missed the history major. Uh, I missed learning about the French and Indian War from time to time. Well, Jeff might not be getting his history fix in the classroom, but he still uses his historical knowledge for video inspiration. I've always had kind of that historical slant, and so I thought of, like, how did Thomas Jefferson really make the Declaration of Independence? Oh, well, what if he pulled an all-nighter? I thought that was funny. Uh, I don't know, like most of the inspiration comes from just observing things, I guess. I guess the ideas, they just kind of pop in. You need to keep your mind open, observe things that you think are silly or should be kind of called out, and you kind of do it. For the past three years, Jeff has been making these crazy videos with the help of friends and fellow Pepperdine classmates, Kyle Health and Seth Allison. I'm always, I always, guy. I guess I'm kind of timid whenever um, Jeff gets me to, to work in a lot of his sketches because I'm never knowing exactly. He's got a definite, definite style of writing and a different way he wants the actor to portray his character. He totally helps out with everyone's sketches, like big or small, freshman, senior, like tiny bump or huge production. Like, it's really cool how much he helps out everybody else, um, even though he's got a lot of his own stuff going on. So out of all his videos, does Jeff have a favorite? Uh, maybe my personal favorite. It was when I was a freshman and I made um, that Superman vs. Soldier Boy tell him video. Would you care to step outside? Superman! Come to me, son of jor -El. Kneel before Soldier Boy! Tell him. But that was the first time when I made a video that I thought was really weird. And like, I didn't, I, I felt I was taking a big risk when I uploaded it to YouTube because I didn't know if anyone was going to like it or not. Guess what, Jeff? They liked it. The Superman video has just under 300,000 views on YouTube. And that's not even his most successful video. Jeff's spoof of Spider-Man has logged more than 900,000 views. I love the Wes Anderson Spider-Man one because I felt that was maybe the first time when I, when I got it right. Like I felt like I made something that other people could really like. I really feel good about that one. TV host Jimmy Kimmel saw the Spider-Man video. He liked it so much that he invited Jeff to do an internship with his late night show this past summer. But it was fun to be on a TV set, you know, or to be in the field and watch how they operate and kind of learn from that. While well, Jeff wasn't busy with the Jimmy Kimmel Show, he was working on his latest video that would take YouTube by storm, the video website. Next week on Newswaves, I'll have the story of the video that had celebrities like Ashton Kutcher tweeting up a storm. For Newswaves, I'm Allie Barrera.